In many applications, we want to plot multiple data sets on a single graph to visualize the relationship between the data sets. Consider a vector of average monthly temperatures in London and another vector containing the months of the year. Recall that we can create a line plot with months on the x-axis and average temperatures on the y-axis using this command. The third input specifies the style of the line plot. In this example, we plot a red dotted line with circular markers. Now suppose we want to visually compare the average monthly temperatures in London and another city. How can we plot the temperatures in both the cities on the same graph? Let's try to add the line plot of temperatures in Rio to the existing graph, again using the plot function. The default behavior of the plot function is to replace older plots in the figure with the most recent plot. This is useful when we are experimenting with data and we do not want to display all the plots at the same time. Thus, in this case, the current graph contains only one line plot representing the temperatures in Rio. To plot both line plots on the same graph, we start by plotting the average temperatures in London. Next, we enter the command hold on, which changes the underlying behavior of the graph such that subsequent plots are added to the graph. In certain applications, we may need to create graphs by combining different plot types. For example, suppose we want to create a graph which combines the bar graph of maximum monthly temperatures with the line plot of average monthly temperatures. We again start by plotting one of the graphs, the bar graph in this example. We then enter the command hold on, followed by the plot function, thus creating a graph having multiple plot types.